You're watching the Paul Corn Bow Hunting Channel. <laughs> and you're watching Paul Corn Bow Hunting Channel! Billy, Billy Mink and put us in a blind where I shot one two years ago, the biggest one I ever killed. He didn't let us go there the first couple of days, but he, he put me in there today because he wants me to get a big one. Thanks for uh, filming me, Bruce, and uh, uh, I'm hunting with uh, Billy Mankin at Billy Mankin's 4J Ranch here in uh, Gillette, Wyoming, and it doesn't get any better than this. It's day number five of hunting mule deer in Wyoming, and the previous two days we were rained out. So it's very encouraging with this cool front and the does and fawns coming in very early in the day. This group of bucks show up from behind the water tank and completely surprise the guys. Bruce Hudala quickly starts the camera as Dad waits for a shot angle. Excellent shot, Dad. He came in at quarter to seven, and everything happened so fast. And two other bucks that was with him, and the big one was behind, and I, I had to shoot through the other two. So I waited till they cleared out a little bit, and he was facing me, but when he turned, he gave me the shot, and I think I hit him good. So we're not going to go after him right away, but, but I, I don't think he's going to go very far because I had a good shot at him. And I, he took her in the shorts, I'm sure. I'm pretty happy. There's still a couple bucks right out here. I'm talking, there's still a couple, a couple of them running around here. I see two of them right now. But we've seen, behind us, we've seen four bucks. So actually that's uh, one, two, three, four, seven different bucks. And there's another one back there that's a shooter, but I'm happy with the one that I shot. It's a dandy. I mean, it'll look really, really good on the wall, because that's a wall hanger. Shortly after Dad hits his buck, I get a text message that they are giving it some time. The shot does look good, but they want to play it safe. As I'm waiting, a group of three bucks, one being a wide shooter, are working their way towards my blind. I am set up on a water tank that the deer, due to the last couple days of rain, really aren't using. So I'm trying to film as they walk by on their way up a draw to an alfalfa field about a half a mile away. I'm going to shoot now. Unfortunately, the deer is not on the camera. My shot looks good. I'm just trying to get a landmark to where he's running. Man, I just hit a big, big mule deer on day five of our Mankin 4J ranch hunt. Man, the deer hung up over on my right side and I was set up to shoot at the water tank. So I swung the camera around. I kind of had it set up so I could do that because I had an opening over here where they come up the draw. I just looked and the footage isn't there. Um, I think I have him walking in behind the screen and he, running away after I shot him. He ran down into a, a, a fairly open draw. Uh, he was quartering to me just a little bit, but the arrow went in, in the right spot, solid deep. So um, I watched him run about 200 yards. I'm hoping he's gonna be laying down there, but. My dad shot a deer about maybe an hour and a half ago. So this is so great because the weather has been so terrible. Um, it rained the last two days. We got rained out. It was really wet get, getting back in here. And I didn't think they were going to come to the water. I had a couple of antelope and a couple of other mule deer that just walked right on by coming up the draw. So I thought I better get set up to shoot over here. Luckily I did. Well, I guess it didn't matter. I didn't really get it. <clears throat> but I came close to getting it by preparing in advance a little bit so anyways I'm gonna call Jaden and Bill and Bruce and my dad and let them know I got one hit <clears throat>
Just before dark, I get the word that they found Dad's deer. We decided to wait until morning before going after mine. Over here, Billy. He's over here. There he is. Oh, is he nice? Man, there he is. There he is right there, boy. There's Big H. There he lays. Beautiful buck. Wow. Now Jaden and I will snap a few picks and then go work on dads. Mank and 4J Ranch 2023. Look at that dandy. Shot that last night. We let it go um, till this morning because uh, he was quartering to me a little bit. <clears throat> and I knew I, I hit part of the shoulder, but the arrow went in almost all the way to the fletching. So I knew it was good, but we waited anyway. He, he did go a few hundred yards, but look at the size of that. That mule deer, unbelievable. Thanks so much to Bill and Cindy Mankin, the 4J Ranch, Bruce Hudala for all his help. Uh, Jaden Long, um, who's been helping us, getting us to the blinds and helping us do the recoveries and stuff. Uh, another great trip. Now, uh, Dad shot one last night about an hour before I shot this one. So we got his already. Um, we're gonna Kneel down, go right. get some pictures of that one. <laughs> Thank you, Bill. Yeah. Well, I just think if he had one more year, I'm glad he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tickled pink he didn't have an extra year. Wow, what a what a hunt. Beautiful deer. Nice, sweet. Well, Dickie, there's your buck. Uh, we were hunting last night on a barley field on a water tank, and uh, this buck came in pretty early kind of surprised us with a couple smaller bucks and we knew right away huh Dickie that's right he was the one so uh, Dickie made a great shot double lunged him and uh, he went off over into a, a big bottom and uh, so we recovered him last evening and uh, it was a tough place to get to so we field dressed him and left him overnight this morning we got the side by side here Bill Mankin at the 4J ranch and uh, went down in the bottom and picked him up and here we go God, great job, great buck, good job, guys. Incredible. Dad, that's your biggest. Biggest one I ever got. <laughs> it, does, it doesn't get any better than this. Is this your favorite hunt? This is my favorite, by ever. far, the favorite <laughs> hunt ever. A few minutes after uh, uh, Dickie shot this buck, we got a text from Paul that he'd shot a buck. And just a beautiful buck. We recovered it this morning. And as you can see by the photos, a beautiful symmetrical Wyoming mule deer. So two beautiful bucks on the last evening of the hunt. We had a weather change. It had been kind of hot. We had uh, thunderstorms go through, a bunch of rain. The temperature dropped probably 30 degrees. And it really had them on their feet last evening. So it was really good. So it's a good hunt. Good memories, a lot of fun. The chances of father and son double team here, you know. Pretty yeah. awesome. And Glad then, to be part of it. Then for Dad to get the monster like that. Oh. Yeah. Good job, Dickie. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Congrats, Dickie. Thanks, guys. Thanks for all your help. No problem. Good job. Thanks. Thanks again to Bill and Cindy Mankin at the 4J Ranch in Gillette, Wyoming. We will never forget this hunt. A real true once-in-a-lifetime.